Well, the countdown is on. Get this, only 180 days until Super Bowl 58 takes over Las Vegas. And thousands of dollars in public money will go toward encouraging entrepreneurs to establish or expand business right here while they're in town for the big game. That's right, and Kelsey McFarland joins us in studio tonight to explain how much money is being handed over. Kelsey. County commissioners agreed to earmark $440,000 for the Super Bowl Corporate Combine. That is a three day event where companies will be invited to learn about the advantages of doing business in Southern Nevada. But multiple residents spoke up during that commission meeting saying they don't think money should be spent on luring more big business to the valley. Trust me when I say very few Clark County residents will be attending the Super Bowl nor will they have equal access to the jobs that these executives might, and I emphasize might, create. In response to those concerns, officials emphasize that the money will be coming from recovery funds set aside for economic development and won't be spent on game day itself. There's actually no public money going into game day activities, so any activities that happen on Sunday, no private money will be, uh, no public money will be used for that. All of the public money will be used for the activities around showcasing our community and highlighting why it's best to do business in Clark County. The money has just been earmarked for now. A final agreement will go before commissioners later. In total, $2.25 million is being requested for this effort from both public and private sources. And tomorrow, the Las Vegas City Council will consider putting in $290,000. Reporting in studio, I'm Kelsey McFarland.